So today we're launching the Island Harbor program here on campus, and this is uh, literally the first of its kind in the state of Texas, and it's part of an a and system initiative to help students who were once in the foster system go to college and become successful. One of the things that we know is true is that when you ask foster kids, uh, foster care kids, what their immediate goals are, it is 80% of them will say it's to get a college degree. But in Texas, only 1.5 of those percent of those kids actually get college degrees right now. So we want the st second statistic to match the first statistic. So what this provides is supervised independent living. And you, many students think of college as a home away from home. But what we really want to provide is a home for these students. With the launch of the supervised living program that's opening up here on campus, I believe it'd be a very successful and very helpful to foster care kids that like myself. It's easier for you to be able to focus on your studies if you're not worried about where you're sleeping or where your next meal is going to come from. The goal of the AM system, I always tell people, is to take ordinary kids and turn them into extraordinary Texans, and that's what um, our system does, we think, better than anybody. In this holistic approach to supporting students, they have housing, they have uh, all the food that they need to, to um, make sure that they're taken care of and have a, a good, reliable home environment. But at the same time, we have counselors and advisors and of course professors, faculty, staff all around campus who are there to provide that extra support to make sure that these students are successful. I love being an Islander. Uh, just the campus feeling and the small environment, it's very peaceful in a way. You can sit outside and make friends with cats while you're studying for your next bio quiz. And I met a lot of friends here. Everybody seems to know each other here. We know these students have incredible skill sets to, to be able to um, meet challenges and obstacles and student success often comes down to grit. Uh, and, and so we want to help these students make sure that any other skills they need, we're helping to provide them with. The first supervised independent living program on any college campus in Texas is being piloted right here in South Texas at Texas State University. The wonderful thing about public servants, it just takes one person to come up to you and say, wow, this made a huge difference in my life and, and uh, I got a college degree as a result of it.